it's so cool. Are right, we gonna let him loose over the? Yeah, actually, it's gonna be beautiful. We really appreciate everyone making that, making this trip out here and uh, spending this and celebrating this uh, momentous occasion with us. Yep. And uh, so we're going to be doing this, the Chinese lantern uh, uh, ceremony. So everyone will get a lantern, we'll light it up and then it'll float off. Make a little wish. Don't tell anyone. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, so I hope you all enjoy. And then afterwards you can uh, continue drinking and hope you have some fun. And then tomorrow is the big day. Yeah. So. <laughs> If it weren't for an old address on a birthday card, none of us might be here today enjoying this warm ocean breeze. But because of a chance encounter on a street in Philadelphia, we are here and we get to witness and lend our support as you make your vows to each other. When I look at Jamie and Marty, I feel so many emotions. I know my sister has found her true love. 
and has so many wonderful adventures ahead of her. I love them as a couple, and I know that they have a solid foundation for marriage because they are best friends. Jamie, is that nice? Thank you. Yeah, they, like once we got down, I was like, oh yeah, this just got real. <laughs> Jamie comes walking down the street and, you know, says I lived, I lived in this house and, and of course everyone, you know, blows the door open, she lived in this house and, and, you know, everyone is really excited about that. But I knew, I just had this mental image of Martin, Martin's face as he met Jamie. And I knew from that second that he was just so impressed with her and just wanted nothing more than to be with her and so he did he said let me give you a tour so you know then then Jamie went on a tour of a house she'd already lived in and <laughs> that night Jamie could have walked down a different street people could have been inside um, none of us could have lived in Philadelphia and um, you stack those nights together and then you get tonight so did you guys decide this is vivid or dull okay <laughs> The argument continues. Yeah. Courts, you're the real best man. <laughs> you're the best man I, I just wanted. felt bad for you. Because I have a three project. I'm going to do it. Thank you. Thank you all for being here. Yeah, for this has been a great trip so far. This is fun. did it. Finished. <laughs> <laughs> Done. Love you, man. Done. Love you too. Real key is make sure you're always the best friends. Right? But that's key. When you're the best friends, you'll do anything for each other. since I've been madly in love with you from the start. I'm overjoyed to take this next step with you in our lives together. I'm so lucky to have such a great man in my life to call my love and best friend. I know our future together will be filled with love, laughter, and adventures. Let our journey begin. I love you. Always. Amazing. Thank you. You look nice. Wow. How was your morning? It's good. How was yours? Good. It took you probably a little bit more fun than yours. Or did you have fun getting ready? I had fun. Good. You nervous? No. Are you? No. You look great. Thank you. Now you finally get to see it. Yeah. It doesn't look anything like I remember. Good. <laughs> so, so I had a completely different memory of it. Good. Good. I like your surprise. Food. Yeah. That's good. Sweet. Love you. Love you too. Today in front of our friends and family, I take you to be my husband. I am proud to be your wife and to join my life with yours. And because of that, I make you these promises. I promise to be faithful and loving and to put you in our marriage first. I promise not to sweat the small stuff. I promise to keep our lives exciting and to make marriage our biggest adventure. I promise to be open and honest with you. I promise to always give you kisses and threes. I promise to order pizza for dinner at least once a month. <laughs> and I promise to keep updating these as we go, because one set of vows cannot cover a lifetime of growing and changing with you. As this list grows, I promise my love will also continue to grow for you every day. When I first started writing these vows, I tried to look over the my life and I started to realize just how lucky I really am. Lucky I have such a, a wonderful and caring family, lucky to have such great friends, and. Lucky that I moved, I just happened to move into a house on, at 616 South 17th Street in Philly and that you would just happen to move out of it just a few months prior. 
and lucky that you would just be happen to be walking down the street when my friends and I just happened to be standing outside, outside on the doorstep. And then I started to get a little bit worried. I got a little worried that I was, I'd used up all the luck in my life in the first 29 years of it. But then I thought harder about the two of us and having you with me, and I realized that as long as we're together, we don't need luck. I can't really put into words how much you mean to me. My promise to you today is to spend the rest of my life proving that to you through my actions. I can't wait to get married to you today. And now, in front of all the family and friends gathered here today, I hereby pronounce you husband and wife. Martin, you may kiss your bride. <laughs> Family and friends, I present to you for the first time, Mr. and Mrs. Martin Zhao. Jamie is a really so is so beautiful girl and I thank you Jamie's parents Pat and Bob for bringing this wonderful girl to this beautiful world and also raising such a beautiful girl May your marriage bring you all the exquisite excitements a marriage should bring. May you need one another, but not out of weakness. May you want one another, but not out of lack. May you look for things to praise, often say, I love you, and take no notice of small faults. May you have happiness, and may you find it in making one another happy. And may you have love, and may you find it in loving one another. Take me back to where we started from